debate in the press. Da, da, da. One up top with two goals. All right, hello and welcome to Bat Chat, the second episode of Bat Chat as we're walking on the way back from the game. God, um, selfie stick now. God. Yeah, no, it's, it's, it's <laughs> illustrated up to that. So it's ended Southampton 2, Coventry City 1. Yeah, God. It wasn't exactly a convincing second half though, was it? No, no, it wasn't a convincing at all. At the beginning of the game I said 1-0 and that was kind of the performance I was expecting, sort of thing where we're going to maybe get a goal ahead yeah. and struggle for the rest of the game. Yeah. Um, we, I think we did well to get to see to, to, get, to get those two goals first half. Um, but it was just difficult second half, wasn't it? Just sluggish, play, really playing in the corners. I, I hate like I'm all for passing it around the back. Yeah. But when you're facing the goal, when you're passing it straight into your own back corner, yeah. What you're doing to yourself, like you're yeah. just just hurting yourself. But you know, bait in the press, bait in the press. Come on. You can say bait in the press, but did it work once in the second half? <laughs> and I'll be honest, those, those subs then they confuse me a little bit. Yeah, do you take a rebo off? Yeah. I didn't understand that one. That one in particular, I didn't understand that one. Well, maybe saving it for the next game, you know, there's a lot of energy he's going to be wasting, but yeah. it's more like oh, Mara on the wing. Why do we. You've got, a, you've got a dozy, you've got Sam on the way in there somewhere. Like, if you're going to make changes to the wing, why don't you just put on a winger rather than someone who's not really working in the, in the position that he's meant to be in? Yeah, when you put it like that, actually, to not have a dozy come on, yeah. whether or not there's a, another reason for that. Um, or even not starting Ryan Frazier out there yeah. from, from the off. I don't really understand. There's a few players like that. And I think we are at a point now where who would you rather see come on in the 75th, Mara or Tyler Dibbling? <laughs> yeah. Well, the sort of player Tyler Dibbling is probably would have done a lot better on well, that one. That's wing. the thing. Like, we're now in a position where, all right, we're going to playoffs. We're not really <laughs> playing for, for much. There's a bit of an on-the-beach thing about it. Yeah. Weird atmosphere tonight, though, wasn't it? Exactly. But, but don't you think that atmosphere gets raised if you start seeing a few academy players playing in these games where it's good to get points, it's good to get momentum? Yeah. In but reality, Coventry, it's, not, it's not an issue if we don't win. No, exactly. But Coventry were a tough test for us. I mean, they're exactly the sort of side that we're going to be playing in the playoffs. Yeah. yeah. Um, so to, to grind out a win the way we did, disappointed not to get a clean sheet, I must say. Yeah. But... Um, I'm glad we're playing the certain teams. Lamppost, lamppost. We're playing certain teams this time of the year. Like I'm quite, although it's the fourth time to play in Watford. Yeah. It's a, it's a, just a good test. It is the fourth time we're playing Watford. Saturday the 13th. Um, but they're going to be another physical side to face. Aren't exactly. They? So playing them before, I think the run of games that we've got towards the end of the season, especially the fact we've got Leicester to play, Leeds to play, it's a good test because if you can come away from those games looking all right, yeah, you can roll into the playoffs, you know, with a little bit of. A little bit of a you know, competence. Yeah. Yeah, no, absolutely. But we are looking at picking up the next two wins here at home. Magnificent looking St Mary Stadium there, over in the distance. But this will be a big confidence boost ahead of those two fixtures. And certainly, as, as Leeds Sunderland ended, I Leeds, so. when we left it, it was 0 0. Well, this is a shoe was 0 0 and go from there. Yeah. But Leicester losing. Away at Millwall, is that right? Yep. Well, no, well, I think they were at home, were they not? Oh, wow. I, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. Either way, it's a result. Flipping it. You never know. If those three teams absolutely bomb the rest of the, the, rest of the season, we can pick up enough points, you never know. Yeah. Or those might still be on. They're going to have to bomb a lot of it, though, aren't they? Hey, listen, I, I've seen us bomb a lot of things this season. <laughs> yeah. So, you know. Exactly that. Well, there it is. Um, Bat chat for the Southampton. 2-1 win against Coventry City. Of course, we will be here for the Saturday game against Watford. Another physical side to face, um, but hopefully another three points. That's always really like. Come on, share, subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. Right. Yeah.